Thank you, Madam Chairwoman and uh, board members. I'm actually here uh, to speak on behalf of Wayne Jacobs, who is the um, Dean of Laternal University and a professor of kinesiology there. As a former public school science teacher and a current faculty and administrator for a teacher education preparation program, I support critical thinking and examining all sides of scientific theories. In 2009, the SBOE voted unanimously 13 to 2 for science standards that teach critical thinking skills to students and allow them to analyze, evaluate, and examine all sides of scientific theories, including evolution. This was welcome news to science educators like me. However, recent reports of materials in the science field have found inaccurate information contained in many of the classroom materials submitted. There is also a continued effort by some <coughs> to censor critical thinking and discussion in the classroom on scientific theories, including debate over creation and evolution. One of the first steps in scientific inquiry is to gather the facts, inaccurate or not complete science information presented to students in Texas schools. This is not only cheating our children from developing skills and critical thinking, it also sets the stage for faculty reasoning and intellectual development in the future. This is not an issue about religion in the schools. It is about presenting all of the facts and all theories for students to consider as they critically analyze the material in their science classes. We owe it to our children to provide them with all the information they need to make scientific decisions and other decisions which will affect their life in years to come. As a science teacher, I provided the full picture of science to my students and gave them the tools to make their own choices. I want Texas to provide that same opportunity to all our children who have privileged enough to enter our school systems. I am pleading today with the SBOE to approve classroom materials that are supposed to follow the standards approved in 2009 that teach critical thinking skills to students and examine all sides of scientific theories. Our Texas students deserve to develop the skills necessary to be successful in the world today and years to come. Dr. Wayne Jacobs. <laughs> 